I go first! Yes! Let's go! Whoop, whoop, whoop! <laughs> Gloom, and today I am back in Roblox drawing Sanrio characters. Comment your favorite character down below. I'm going to be going into all of your favorite art games. We're going to be doing speed draw, draw a blank, spray paint, and all kinds of other stuff. So let's hop into game. Okay, okay. So we have the theme birthday. Um, I'm thinking let's draw one of the Sanrio characters as it's like their birthday. Um, I'm thinking Pachaco. He does not get enough love. So let's jump right into drawing Pachaco. Um, I want to make like some really cute like little birthday banners, some little polka dots on the on the wall. I don't know. We're trying to make it look festive here. Um, and then now we got to get to the the nitty gritty. Okay. Um, I'm gonna start drawing Pachaco. I love how his little ears like flop up and down. It's the most adorable thing. It totally reminds me of my dog because she's black and white too. Um, let's give Pachaco a little shirt. Of course, his little feetsies um, and a party hat. Come on, it's not a birthday without your party hat. Um, and then, oh, he needs like like a little party blower or something. And some blushy cheeks. Can I squeeze? Oh, no, I didn't get to finish the outline. <laughs> okay, let's see what everyone else drew. Oh, okay, we got a little birthday cake. That's pretty cute. I like that. <laughs> Why does it look like it's Baldy Basics' birthday? Like, <laughs> I'm giving that four stars just because it looks like Baldy. <laughs> Here's mine. I think it turned out pretty cute. I wish I would have finished the outline. Uh, I need to draw faster. I know this is speed draw, but I can never draw fast enough. Okay, and the winners are, let's see, fingers crossed. Yes, I took third place. I will take that. Not mad at all. I'm so happy that Baldy won though. <laughs> happy birthday to Baldy. <laughs> okay, next round is scary. How am I going to make Sanrio scary? Actually, I love kind of like mashing up like super cute and like creepy things together. Um, and I think Karomi is like the perfect character to do that with. So let's draw a super creepy Karomi. I'm so excited. Okay, I, I'm trying to make the lines like really sketchy because um, I think that makes it look a little creepier. We're going to give her like a lot of teeth because uh, that's scary. <laughs> She looks like she's gonna bite somebody. Um, okay, so she her outline looks pretty good. Um, I gotta fill in the back though really quick. She definitely needs like her blackish little hood thing. And then we gotta do um some pink on there, probably like the pink skull, little blushies, and I wanna give her like red eyes because that's that's scary. <laughs> okay, she's looking pretty good. I'm gonna go with that. I'm happy. Okay. <laughs> that is kind of scary. It looks like a fly, like a gigantic fly. Like, you ever get bit by a fly? It hurts. I think that's pretty scary. <laughs> this one's just like two eyes. And then is that like a bunch of teeth in the background? I don't know what it is. Teeth are like the scariest thing ever. Oh, this looks like they're like in the woods and they're like being eaten by like some sort of like a creepy woodland spirit thing. I like that one. <laughs> oh, <laughs> it's Henry. Henry the ghost. We love you, Henry. You're so cute. You're not quite scary, but I'm still going to give it three stars because... Henry's adorable. I'm sorry. <laughs> Here's mine. I think if you were going to make Sanrio creepy and scary, I think I did a pretty good job. So I'm hoping I at least make the top three. I'm pretty proud of this. I think it's so cute. Like, I want to redraw this later. It's super cool. No, <laughs> I didn't get in the top three at all. But I'm glad at least Henry made it. <laughs> Congrats, Henry. Ooh, dessert. I love drawing me some food. Okay, let's go. I'm thinking I want to make um, a little ice cream cone because ice cream is probably the superior dessert if we're being honest here. Um, but like, let's turn it into my melody. It'll be so super adorable. Okay, it's like strawberry ice cream. Um, and then we got to draw her little face in there. Oh, she's looking so super cute. Um, and then of course, we've got to give her like a little bit of an outline. And then this is where I'm going to kind of try to create like that, I don't know, waffly texture. I think it looks pretty adorable. The eyes need to be slightly bigger though. And yes, yeah, some blush on the cheeks and a little highlights looking juicy. <laughs> okay, I think she's adorable. Fingers crossed. I, I think this is it, guys. I think I'm going to get first place with this one. Ooh, someone else did ice cream just like me. This is really good. I'm going to give that three stars. Oh my gosh, someone else did Karomi. Yes, we have another Sanrio fan up in here. Let's go. I'm giving that four stars just for the Karomi. I don't even care what it is. <laughs> And then here's my, my melody. I think she's adorable. Um, if this does not make top three, um, I'm going to rage. <laughs> okay, moment of truth. <laughs> but hey, Karomi won, so that's okay. We still got Team Sanrio in the top. I came in fifth place. Come on, guys. 
Ooh, strawberry! There is nothing cuter than a bunch of strawberries. Um, but how am I gonna make it Sanrio? Okay, I'm gonna make um one of the characters wearing like a little strawberry hood. Let's do cinema roll, because it'll be so cute. Okay, um, we're gonna have his little ears like flopping in the wind, and he's gonna be flying around with his cute little tail. Um, and then we gotta give like the little strawberry leaves down there, um, and his blue eyes, blushy cheeks, of course. Cinema roll has like the cutest mouth ever. I just love drawing his mouth. Um, we're gonna do a really quick quick little outline he's looking so good um and then i think maybe just like some sparkles in the background um i think that always adds some cute points oh yeah and then i need the strawberry seeds oh my gosh i almost forgot let's see if i can finish oh my gosh <sighs> that was so hard <laughs> i love it that's amazing <laughs> four stars Here's mine! Come on, cinnamon rolls looking precious per usual. I think I have a good chance of making it in the top. I, I keep saying that and not ending up there, so I don't really know, but I feel like it deserves it. Oh, but come on, this strawberry is so good! Oh my gosh, look at the shading on that thing! Okay, five stars, I have to. But when I see some good shading, I, I can't help myself. Five stars immediately. <laughs> I got first! Yes! Let's go! Whoop, whoop, whoop! <laughs> I always have a squishy on hand for celebratory reasons, okay? <laughs> it just happened to be Cinema Roll. He gave me good luck. I It was Cinema Roll. It was all him. <laughs> oh, okay! We have the theme princess. This is adorable. Let's draw Hello Kitty because, of course, she is the princess of Sanrio. The queen, maybe, even. Okay. All right. We're going to give her an adorable little heart crown. And then, like, a super cute, like, princess dress. So fluffy and adorable. Okay. Um, she needs some arms and legs. Okay. Um, I'm only down to, like, a minute. I have to hurry up and color this in. I don't know if I'm going to finish, guys. Um, okay. Pink dress. Uh, okay. Lighter pink. <laughs> she's got some blush on her cheeks. Okay. Um, she's got a yellow nose. And then, oh, no. I forgot. I have to fill in the background. I'm, I'm not going to make it, guys. No, no, no. <laughs> I shouldn't have filled in the background. Oh. <laughs> this looks like a little puppy dog. It's very cute, but not a princess. Aw, oh, here's Princess Hello Kitty. I mean, she's not bad, but um, I definitely didn't get to color her in all the way, so I don't think I'll make the top this time. Oh my gosh, this one is so good. It almost looks like, um, like a character from Steven Universe. Who is that? It's so good, though. This one deserves to win five stars. Oh my gosh, I love it. Okay, and the winners are... I actually got second place. I am so shocked. The one in first, though. Oh my gosh, it's so pretty. I love it. That was so good. Okay, I may have bought this theme just because I'm feeling festive. It is almost Easter. So, um, yeah, we're going to draw some Easter. I think we're going to do um, Pom Pom Perrin, but we're going to draw him as, like, the little Easter bunny, or at least in, like, an Easter bunny costume because, come on, it's so cute. We're going to put his little brown beret. We got to get his face drawn on there. And then um, I'm going to make his costume look really extra fluffy because he's a bunny. And then we need those little adorable feet. And then, um, yeah, we got to have that. We got to have the toe beans can't forget the toe beans. I think he needs like a bow tie though. That's very Easter Bunny-ish. Um, and then let's give him like some little eggs. I have like 30 seconds. I think I could do it. The little Easter eggs. And then I think we're perfect for Easter. Oh my gosh. He's so cute. Okay, let's see what everyone else has done for Easter. Uh, I, I'm not seeing the Easter <laughs> Oh my gosh, look how cute this bunny is. That's really super good. If it had legs, I would give it five stars. I'll give it four, even if it doesn't have any legs. <laughs> Here's mine. He looks adorable. I love Pom Pom Prune. He's like such a cute little pudgy guy. How can you not love him? Come on. I, I think I deserve five stars. <laughs> oh my gosh. Look at the cinema roll. And he's got little eggs in his basket. Come on. His little face is precious. I can't help it. I'm going to have to give this one five stars. They deserve it. Yes. Oh, we all three tied. Are you serious? I think that's a first for me, a three-way tie. That is insane. Let's go. <laughs> okay, we are headed into Draw and Spawn, one of my favorites. We got some doodles in here battling it out. That bee is amazing. Oh my gosh, what is this? Is it like a little robot or like an astronaut guy? That's so cool. Okay, so I'm going to start off drawing um, Lala from the Little Twin Stars. She is the girl twin, and I'm going to put her in an adorable little pink Easter egg costume because I'm still in the Easter spirit, okay? <laughs> So we're going to start off with like some classic like Easter egg designs and then I want to draw her adorable little face peeking out with her 
pink hair so we know that it is indeed Lala. Um, and then we want to give her like her classic little smile, blushy cheeks, and then I want to give it like a little bit of an outline so she's popping, you know. <laughs> And then one of my favorite things about this game is you could use different parts to like animate your doodle in different ways. So for the ears, I'm actually gonna use an arm and leg part because it'll make them wiggle back and forth. It'll be really adorable. I think she needs a bow in front of her ears though. Um, and then I wanna add just a few more details um, around like the little design pattern we've got going on the egg. One other thing that I think is gonna make this really fun is to add a wheel part. Um, and then we're gonna put little sparkles on the wheel because um, that'll make it like kind of spin around my drawing and make it look like it's really sparkling. I think that would be a super cute addition. Oh my gosh. Okay, so now it's time to start drawing Kiki and here is a little hack for you guys. I love to take a part that I'm not gonna use and um, kind of trace with that so that way I know it's gonna be the exact same size and shape as the other one so they can legit be twins, okay? <laughs> So that's what I did is I just used a part that I know I don't need so I can uh, delete it later and then just traced over my original design so I can start drawing um, Kiki. So we're gonna put him in a blue egg again because that's his signature color. And we're gonna do just like a really similar design. They're both, um, you know, they're twinning. They're little Easter eggs. They're living their best life. Okay, I just spawned them as pets. Look how cute they are. They've got their sparkles sparkling. The ears are wiggling. They are so super cute. I love how they follow you around everywhere you go. It's like I got my two best friends. <laughs> Okay, but I'm feeling a little mischievous. I want to spawn them as like mega huge bosses. <laughs> They're just like towering over all the doodles. Yes, I love it. <laughs> oh my gosh, look at that guy flying around. That's so cool. <laughs> They're over here like battling it out right now. Yes, get him Kiki. <laughs> They're gonna kill that guy in his house. <laughs> Oh my gosh, everyone's like totally whomping on him now. No! Oh my gosh, no, she just killed Lala! How dare you! <laughs> F in the chat for Lala, guys. We need to get revenge on her. How dare she kill them? It's time to nuke the entire server, I don't care. Justice for Lala! <laughs> Okay, here we are in draw a blank. Let's see our first prompt. It says, every night I see a blank in my dreams. Hmm, who am I gonna see in my dreams? Um, I think I'm gonna draw one of my favorite Sanrio characters. We're gonna draw Hangyu Don because he's just a weird, a weird little character and I love him. Um, some people might think it was a nightmare if they saw Hangyu Don in their dreams, but for me, that would, that would be a beautiful dream, okay? <laughs> He's just a silly little fish guy. Um, okay, so we're gonna start off with like his super teal body. We gotta give him like his big bulging eyes and like his um, pink fish lips. <laughs> and we're gonna make him kind of like winking. He's super adorable. Um, we're gonna go in and give him a nice like good solid outline. He's looking legit. I I'm very pleased with myself so far. Um, and who wouldn't wanna like, you know, give me five stars for hanging on. <laughs> I think I'm starting out strong this round. Okay, this person sees a rainbow in their dream sets. That's, that's pretty cute. <laughs> Look at this little guy. It looks like Mike Wazowski. <laughs> yes, slay. <laughs> this looks like a nightmare. <laughs> I give it the scared face. If you see that every night in your dreams, you should, you know, talk to a doctor or something about that. Oh, look, it's another Sanrio fan. We've got some cinema roll in the house. Let's go, four stars. He's so cute. Here's my hanging you down. Let's see if they like hanging you down as much as they like a cinema roll. Come on, give me five stars. <laughs> oh, look at this little kitty cat. A pumpkin, shut up. Okay, four stars. That's really adorable. Giving it lots of heart eyes. Okay, and the winners are... Woohoo! I got second place. I am not mad at all that I lost to the pumpkin cat. And I love that cinema roll was up there with me too. Let's go. So cute. Cutest round ever, for real. Okay, next round. Let's see. They found a planet made entirely of blank. Um, okay. Let's see. What, what Sanrio character could I turn into a planet? I think I'm gonna go with Gudetama because um, he's an egg. Eggs are kind of round, planets are round. So I think it's fitting. We're gonna draw his little Yoki body um, and we gotta add in like the little um, like dark orange shadows and the white highlights. Um, we're gonna make his like little lazy egg face. He's so cute. And then we gotta add like the space behind him. And then I'm gonna make like the white of the egg kind of like Saturn rings going around. 
Um, I, I don't know if it makes any sense, but to me it looks really cool. <laughs> I, I want to visit this planet in real life. It would be amazing. <laughs> We're going to add some stars in the background. And I think his eyes need to be like slightly bigger. Okay, I feel really proud of this. I think this is a good one. Ah, uh, uh, and... Uh, <laughs> A planet made entirely of cheese? Yes! 100%! I would love to live on that planet. Mmm, cheese. Cheese is probably like my favorite food. No, this one looks like Darwin, I think. Is that Darwin? Is it a goldfish? I think so. Ooh, I think that's supposed to be like a little sparkle or a diamond. Very cute. Okay, here's my good Tama. I think he's a sleigh. Let's see what everyone else thinks. Okay, I'm getting like some hundreds, some sleighs, some cool guys with sunglasses. <laughs> Oh, I didn't make it in the top. Come on. Who doesn't love Gudetama? The egg planet. You, you know I should have been up there. <laughs> I'm not handling my loss very well. I was in last place. <laughs> okay, I can't forget my blank when I go camping. Okay, who would I take camping with me? You know, if there's one Sanrio character that I think would be the best to go camping with, I think it would have to be Kuropi. He's uh, the cutest little frog ever, and he just feels like he belongs in the camping atmosphere. So let's draw us some little Kuropi. Of course, I have to add us like a little tent in the background. Otherwise, um, it would be a very creepy camping experience. I'm not one of those people that could like sleep out underneath the stars. No, thank you. I don't want those bugs all over me. <laughs> I need my tent and I need to zip it closed. <laughs> okay, we've got Kuropi and his little rosy cheeks. Um, let's put a moon and some stars in the background because that's the best part of camping is seeing all the stars for me anyways. Um, I think he needs some stripes on his shirt and then we'll just put like hearts because I have extra time. I'm convinced that putting hearts around whatever you draw is going to get you extra points. <laughs> Okay, we got an umbrella. That's actually pretty smart. You might actually need that when you go camping. So I'm going to give that three stars. Someone's going to bring their phone. If you're going like real camping though, your phone's not going to work. So I'm only giving that two stars. Like if you're going like camping, camping, you're going to be going out where there's like no service. Okay. <laughs> Here's my little Kuropi. He's cute. Um, is he giving camping realness? I'm not sure. But hopefully people will give me points because he's cute. <laughs> I didn't win again! Haters! <laughs> they hate me! They hate Sanrio! <laughs> they give me five stars one! That's, that's so lame, I'm sorry. <laughs> okay, next prompt. Someone ate all the blank in the fridge. Doesn't that make you so mad whenever you're like saving a tree and somebody eats it in the fridge? That's the worst. <laughs> Okay, what would be in my fridge that I wouldn't want someone to eat? Okay, I'm going to draw pom-pom pudding, but as a pudding. People always get mad at me because I say pom-pom pudding, but if you know the Japanese pronunciation, I'm not wrong, okay? That's how they say it. <laughs> He's, he looks like a pudding. He's supposed to be a pudding. That's just how they say it in Japanese, okay? So don't come at me. It's pom-pom pudding, okay? <laughs> and we're going to draw him as a pudding because that's so cute. He looks like a little flan or something. Um, we're going to give like some little drippy sauce going around him and put him on a plate. This is so cute. Like, I want to go to a little Hello Kitty cafe and order this in real life. And I have some extra time. I think he needs a cherry on top because that's cute. Why not? Okay, someone ate all the food, but specifically a donut. Who keeps donuts in their fridge? Like, I like donuts. I appreciate the drawing, but I, I don't keep donuts in my fridge, so I'm only going to give it three stars. <laughs> Someone ate all the cake. That would be really sad if someone ate all the cake out of the fridge and did not save you a bite. <laughs> someone ate all the burgers in the fridge. Man, that would be a sad day too. Here's my pudding. Uh, he looks so cute. Like not to toot my own horn or anything, but toot toot. Let's go. <laughs> they love it. I'm getting slays. Yes. <laughs> they didn't draw what's missing. They're just so baffled by the empty fridge. <laughs> Ooh, a pizza! I love it! I don't know why, this pizza really speaks to me. Maybe just because I love pizza. <laughs> okay, what is our? Come on, let's see pom-pom pudding in the top! No! <laughs> haters, haters, haters! <laughs> That's okay, we'll still cheer for the winners. Oh no, she's like really sad she didn't make it in the top, I think. Uh, I know, it's like nobody's really voting, it's okay. It happens to everybody, like I'm not winning either. I pretend I'm all mad about it, but really it's not a big deal. It's okay. <laughs> I'm sure she'll get up there next time. Okay, it's raining blank. Okay, what's it gonna rain? I have to resist the urge to draw tacos. <laughs> okay, um, first off, I gotta think what character have I not drawn yet. 
Um, I really want to draw Choco Cat because I love Choco Cat. So let's put him out in the rain. Um, he's just like so adorable. I love black cats in general. They're just so super cute. Um, so we're gonna draw him and then probably holding like a little umbrella. I feel like um, that would be you know, a normal thing if you're standing in the rain. His eyes are looking kind of crooked, but we're not gonna talk about that, okay? <laughs> Just accept it. <laughs> Okay, um, I feel like we need some something raining from the sky. I'm just gonna put hearts. Maybe that's a cop-out, but I don't care. Um, and then we're gonna add in the last little details. I think he's missing his collar. Okay, yeah, that looks way better. <sighs> okay, that was like strenuous to get that drawn in time. <laughs> this is the lamest answer. <laughs> Yes, the major tacos are out of the sky, 100%. Although I'm, I'm deleting one star because there's something pink on that taco and I'm concerned. <laughs> Who's this little banana guy? <laughs> I love him, three stars. Okay, here's my Choco Cat. I think he looks really super cute, but it doesn't fit the theme super well. So if I don't make it in the top, I will not be surprised. Someone's laughing at me. Okay, I'm getting some slays. <laughs> Just sadness. It's raining sadness from the sky. <laughs> okay, let's see. And the winners are... Oh, I actually made second! And yes, the tacos, it was the girl that didn't win too! Oh my gosh, full circle moment. I'm so happy for her. Yay! You go, tacos! <laughs> Okay, I'm jumping straight into Doodle Transform. I haven't been in here in a while and I just saw that they did an update. So I'm really excited to check it out. Um, I think I want to draw Hello Kitty in here because I feel like I haven't given her enough love in this video. We need to, we need more Hello Kitty, okay? So um, we're gonna draw her in like she's holding a little strawberry. Like maybe my favorite Sanrio style is whenever they kind of have like the little fluffy outline. I don't know why, it's just super cute to me. So that's how I want to draw her and I'm putting her in like an adorable little spring dress. It's it's like kind of plaid. Um, we're gonna use the opacity to kind of give it that plaid effect. And then same with her bow, a little blushy cheeks. Okay, I think the strawberry could use a little bit of shading or something. So we're gonna kind of like give it a little bit of highlights and draw in those little seeds and then the green part for the leaves. And I think she's looking pretty adorable. Um, let's go ahead and apply it. What is, okay, this is part of the new update. Would you like to buy custom doodle? Okay, yes. Let's see what that does. Oh, okay, so I can change the size, I can rotate it, and then there's effects too. Okay, um, I think I'm gonna make it sparkly because yes, of course. And then let's make her huge. <laughs> okay, that's really super cute, but for some reason I was kind of hoping that she would be like gigantic, maybe because I was just in Draw and Spawn where you can literally make them giants. Here's the other part of the update, it's a soundboard. Please tell me there's a fart, yes. <laughs> that's all I wanted, it was a fart. <laughs> Okay, but you know what? The only thing that could make a fart better is a uh, fart with reverb, so... <laughs> yes, I'm gonna go ahead and import that. <laughs> Why am I like this? <laughs> okay, um, I wanna go ahead and make her smaller and check out the other effects. Ooh, yes, look at me, I'm on fire! <laughs> okay, it's time to fart on everybody again. Let's go. <laughs> Let's go, let's go annoy everyone. There's only like two people over here, but I, I'm gonna bother them until they log out. <laughs> this is the best update to Doodle Transform ever. This is all I ever wanted with my life. <laughs> this poor person. I'm just harassing them with the <laughs> Yes. <laughs> Okay, here we are in spray pay. I'm gonna go back to my favorite little spot back behind the trains where um, no one finds me to scribble on top of my art. <laughs> and then I want to draw two characters that I've never drawn on my channel before. Um, and I'm thinking I wanna do like a really pretty little soccer scene because um, it's kind of, I think it's getting close to or it is soccer season in Japan. So that's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna draw like a little cherry blossom tree over here with two characters. Let me know if you guys can guess these ones down in the comments. They're maybe a little lesser known, so I'll be super impressed if you guys know who these are. But first things first, we're gonna draw our little cherry blossom tree. Um, and I'm just kind of like putting in some pink lumps. Um, <laughs> some pink lumps and then we're gonna add like a few little blossoms here and there to kind of um, give the effect without having to draw every individual flower because um, I'm lazy. <laughs> and then I wanna draw like some of the petals like blowing in the wind because that just 
sounds so pretty. If there's one thing I want to do before I kick the bucket, that is the um, Japan and cherry blossom season. I think it would be so super pretty. So yeah, that's what we're doing. Um, I think these are looking pretty good. I want to add in some little shadows to kind of give like the bushy leaves um, some definition here. And then it's time to give this tree some highlights. And yeah, I wanna go ahead and clean up this little sketch here. Okay, we are gonna start with our two little characters that are down here hanging out underneath the cherry blossom tree. We are going to kind of just like block in the colors um, and then... <laughs> You're welcome. <laughs> okay, we're gonna block in these two characters. One of the bunnies is like super, super fluffy. So we're giving her like almost like poodle-like ears, which are really cute. Um, and then I love the other bunny has like a color block style, which I think is really adorable. And then this bunny over here is like, has like an adorable little pearl necklace of some kind. So I'm drawing that in and she has a gigantic bow on her head. So we must add in those little details. And then um, once we have all that done, I wanna move on to their little faces. We're gonna give her some slay lashes. Um, and then a cute little face. Look how adorable she is, little blushy cheeks. Ah, it's looking so super cute. And then we're gonna move back to the other bunny and add in the missing little details. She's got a little flower by her ear and draw her cute little face. Oh my gosh, they just look like so excited to be hanging out together. I just imagine that they're having like the best little day hanging out underneath the cherry blossoms. <laughs> at all today burps and sneezes <laughs> okay okay um we are all finished here they look so super cute we have uh sakura on the left and usahana on the right i think they are so so cute and i wish that there was more love for these two characters because uh, they're some of my favorites let me know down in the comments did you guys guess sakura and usahana let me know and let me know which characters i missed and which ones you want to see me draw next and i'll see you in the next one guys bye